Hey, what is up heroes and welcome to Pokemon A Star in the Desert. I gotta say how that little title came in, that was pretty cool. But this is another game made for the EV Expo and I gotta say I'm very, very excited for this game. When I saw the screenshots on Twitter, I was like, yes, another game where you get to play as a Pokemon. They are my favorite fan games. They're just always so fun to play. So this game was developed for the EV Expo Game Jam 2024. If you guys wanna play this, check the pinned comment in the comment section down below. And let's jump right into it. So we only had a few weeks to work on it, so please be patient for any bugs or issues. We recommend leaving a comment in the game thread on evexpo.com. Thank you. All right, here we go. Oh. Oh. Sure it's hot out here? Don't you feel that? Absolutely, man. Right now in the UK, it's actually pretty hot and I hate it. But you do, right? I do. Wait, that's not right. Shouldn't be able to feel anything yet. That's because this is a world endured only by Pokemon. So, before you go any further, you have to answer some questions. Oh, nice. But don't worry, you don't have to be honest when you answer them. Oh, I'm going to be honest as I can. In fact, sometimes it's better to lie in order to get the things you want. Let us begin. Okay then. So, your friend questioned your math knowledge. How do you respond? Ooh, uh... Dude, you suck at it too. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm pretty good at math. I mean, at school, math was my best subject, but... I mean, that was a long time ago, so I'd probably say, dude, you suck at it too. So it's hot outside, what kind of ice cream do you want? Ooh. <sighs> hmm. Chocolate thing. Depends what kind of chocolate. The reason I've been going for like a white chocolate ice cream. I do like, I don't mind vanilla, but. Mmm. Not be kind of pistachio. I'll, I'll go chocolate. Can't go wrong with chocolate. So quick, think fast. Uh. What? <laughs> So a new game just came out. Let's get it. Uh, I'll grab my wallet. Not till it's on sale. So I, uh, I have this, uh, I have this problem where I buy like every game I want that comes out, and I just don't ever get to play it. So I'll, I'll have to say I grab my wallet. So you've suddenly gained a massive following. What's next? I mean, how big we talking? How big we talking? Because if I gained, I you know like hundred million. Try to take over the world, just saying that'd be pretty fun. Uh, hey, can I have some grapes? Uh, no man, get your own. Have you played the critically acclaimed video game everyone's talking about? Final Fantasy XIV? Well, yes, I've been playing right now. I'm actually grinding the uh, um, the Arcadian stuff, get some new gear, but uh, yeah, of course. So someone's looking for you, uh, but you're in bed. Uh, nah, I'm still sleeping. Uh, how well do you take a loss? Ah. Uh, it depends on the game I'm playing, because sometimes like, I learn an experience, you know? But a lot of times, like, if I'm playing like League, Valorant, a loss is unacceptable. If I'm playing like a new game, I mean, it's a learning experience. If I'm playing a game for fun, it's all good. But in this case, like, I mean, right now I'm playing a lot of Valorant, gotta finish the battle pass off, but doing a lot of rank training, my rank sub, if I lose, it's unacceptable. Gotta win. But you arrive at a bowl of candy, there's a sign that says, please take one, or take one, please. Uh, I only take one. Uh, do you want to be referred to in male or female terms? We'll go male. Oh, and the questions I see. So from these sets of points, we shall make them whole. So who am I? The questions you've answered? Did you end up answering them honestly? After all, I did. Whether you did or not, you've created a vessel with the choices you've made. And the type of characteristic for that vessel is the mischievous type. Okay. You're someone who uh, loves causing trouble or at the uh, very... Or at the very, uh, someone with a great sense of humor. I mean, I try. When given the opportunity for chaos, you'll probably be the first to consider- I mean, I, I, I'm always down for a bit of chaos. But with both of these traits combined, that actually makes you a bit of a thinker as well. But shouldn't you learn to read the room and know when to do good? I mean, yeah, I guess. Regardless, someone like you? Oh, it's like the Pokemon Poplio. Personality results. Attack 2, Defense 6, Speed 2, Special Attack 10. Switch Defense 5 and HP 8. Okay. Uh, I want to see what Pokemon there is, so choose Pokemon. Really? Well, to be honest, I believe you should uh, be allowed to do that. So we got Charmander, Chikorita, Mudkip, Turtwig, Oshawa, Finnekin, Popolio, Chespin, Foy, Coco, Fanfiriolo, and Chino. All right, we'll go with uh, we'll go with Popolio. That's what we got for the quiz. We'll take it. Very well. So now that you've chosen your reflection, it's time for you to go. 
Okay. So you're really just going along with this? Absolutely. Truth be told, I can't really tell you anything else right now, so that's quite convenient of you to do so. Now, get out of here, you. The world awaits. I'm excited, man. Here we go. So this feeling. It feels like something is sliding against my head. And it's hot. It's so hot that it's almost unbearable. It feels like I'm melting. Oh. Got a sobble in a hat, man. Why oh, he's dragging us? The hat kind of reminds me of Luffy's. <laughs> ah, oh, not anymore, actually. From the little portrait, it's more like a little cowboy hat, but you're awake. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Wasn't going to do anything bad, I swear. Uh-huh. I saw you lying face first in the sand, and there's a sandstorm, and it's really hot, and... And? Don't cry. Do not cry. Um... Are uh, you alright? Eh, I mean better. Me? A talking Pokemon? Yeah, I suppose. I guess we shouldn't take things for granted. If that's what you mean. You and me both, eh? You're a what? A human? Um... What? Uh, no. Don't have any mints on me. <laughs> Wait. Oh, it's true. Turn to a Pokemon? That's... Uh... I mean, depends what Pokemon I get turned into. An utter nightmare, dream contract. I mean, a Poplio. I mean, if I could evolve into a Primarina, I wouldn't be too mad. Primarinas are pretty cool, but... uh, Yeah, dream come true. Why not? Incredible. I've always wanted to be a Pokemon. God, I can't believe this is happening. Hey, this is a really bad place to uh, talk wisdoms, I think. And, um, you aren't mad at me for dragging you across the desert, right? Uh, nah, as long as you save me, it's all good. Oh, that's a relief. Oh, I'd hate to be branded an outlaw over something like this. So, hey, why don't we hurry out of this... Oh, out of the way. Oh, hey. <laughs> Wait, uh, that's the wrong one. Thief! Oh. Ah! Hey, stop doing that! So what was the second point? I didn't catch it, but huh. But wait, wait, wait. Oh, it's a uh, golette. So you two! Assistance, please! Uh, huh. Oh, for a second there, I thought you were mad at me. No time to waste! I need that artifact back. I can't fight her, myself. You want me to go after that thief? Uh, I don't know how to tell you this, but I think that's a pretty bad idea. Um... Huh, you don't wanna? Uh, no, it's not that I, I just don't wanna make any bad promises. Likely, but you two are my only choice. Don't you wanna at least give it a try? I'm, as they say, running out of options. <laughs> Gee, thanks. Uh, what am I doing? This is my big chance. I just... Yeah, I could really use you right now. Me? Let's go. Let's take them down. Let's beat them up. Uh, actually, no, yeah. Let's go. Alright. Oh, and I've collapsed. Uh, are you okay? I... This body. I can barely stand up. I mean, we haven't got legs anymore. <laughs> I notice you're having a lot of trouble walking. Are you sure you're okay? But we're running out of time. I'll just have to get used to it. So the grassy dunes. Hmm. I definitely saw that croc rock, croc rock run off here. I guess we could start off by taking a look around. Oh. Wait, that's right. I... What should I call you? Like, you know, if there's two of you in the room, what do I call you? Uh, right, so, use the keyboard. Faulty. Oh, okay, I just put the FPS on the screen. Uh, ah, press Y. If you want to put the FPS on the screen for whatever reason, press Y. Well, well Faulty. Well, that's interesting. I'm sorry, I just don't think I've ever heard a Poplio go by Voltsy before. Uh, but you know what? I don't think it's weird at all. Just different. People just call me Sobi. Sobi the Sobble. So let's do our best, Voltsy. Alright, so head for the goal, use the arrow keys to move. You can press C to interact with objects and V to open the menu. If you don't like these controls, F1 will let you rebind each one. You can even play with a controller too, which I am using a controller. Uh, welcome to the Grassy Dunes. 
Please refrain from cutting down the tall grass as it serves as a wonderful place to lie down and relax in. Some Pokemon also love hiding within the textures of tall grass. It's also incredibly hard to regrow once it's gone. Thank you. Alright, so that's the bag. So a human turned Pokemon discovered by Sobby and they're looking for the reason they were summoned to this world. Got Torrent, Water Gun to summon voice, okay. I love the uh, like the background, the party menu, that looks so sick. Uh trainer card. Okay. And nothing in our bag. Alright, let's go. Alright, let's get into a few fights if we can. Oh. Come on, there's a P on the ground. It's gonna be like gold. Oh. So I can't get to that yet. Oh, hey, oh. Hey, you. Ah, an ambush. Yeah, that's right. Get off our tails, why don't you? Tails? Oh, what do you mean, tails? Yes, tails. And mine's bigger than yours. Look, I, I, I meant that like. M ah, kiss the dirt, nerd! <laughs> I like in the writing so far. Alright, so we are gonna go for Water Gun. Nice, got a critical hit there. Oh, that was easy. Ouchie, I gotta get out of here. <laughs> Help! Sheesh, what's with that kid? I think it's pretty safe to say that uh, Crocorock isn't working alone, Foxy. So. Oh, no, B slows us down, I think, but take this! Oh. Got another one. Kind of like to get used to the controls here. But I think, uh, yeah. If you want to slow down for whatever reason, press B on the controller. Not sure that is on the keyboard. Also, looking at it, isn't. Oh, uh. Isn't Sobble's tail technically bigger than Sandile's if, like, you unravel it, I guess? Actually, I'm not even sure if the tail can un unravel, but. Huh, it's like orange berries. That's suspicious. Uh, these dropped items are starting to seem a little generous. Not only that, did that croc rock just uh, gloss over it? Yeah, so, oh, sorry, Voltsy. Uh, these things are actually pretty rare. Berries are actually really hard to grow with the uh, desert and all that. I'm actually surprised you didn't know that. But yeah, if you're hurt, feel free to help yourself. I just see Sobby uh, mutter something under his breath. <laughs> I love the little, like, drawings there of uh, the Pokemon for tutorial stuff. However, they are not very easy to find, so use them wisely. Okay. Let's just let you hold that. Yeah, so that slows us down. Uh, that's the menu. Okay, cool. Oh! Uh, yeah, and they're coming this way. That's messed up, dude. They messed you up, bro. <laughs> Pretty messed up, yo. Um, hello? Scatter! <laughs> Alright then. I mean, it's kind of good we've got like two water types right now. I search every nook and cranny for different kinds of items. Everything has value to someone, so even if you find something you can't use, maybe it's worth giving to a friend. Okay. Uh, is there a set of brambles in the way? Can't proceed. Okay then. Oh, sweet! Spare cloth, but I say, should I check the rocks just in case? Nothing of value. Alright, I'll start checking the uh, the rocks then, in case we find some stuff. Hey, a plain seed. Alright. Take this! Keep trying to fight me, but honestly, not great for you. Alright, just water gun. And water gun. Easy. <laughs> hey! Honestly, this is making me want to play a mystery dungeon game. Like, I want a new one so bad. Uh oh. Oh, there's a shiny one there. Alright, dorks. Behold, our final and most powerful formation. Yeah! 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 <laughs> How large is this family? Hey! Wait for the little one to speak. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! 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 Okay, it's your turn now. <laughs> okay, then. Yeah. Good enough. Okay, everyone, pile on. All right. A lot of sand dial. Okay, just torment. It's fine. Just gonna keep water gunning. Uh, 
and that lowers my accuracy. Please don't miss. Just, yeah, keep spamming. Water gun should be fine. As long as I don't miss. We've got the berry on him, got some more berry. Oh, I can't use it twice in a row. Uh, to summon voice. Are they part dark now? Or do they gain a dark type? I forget. And we'll find out if this is super effective or not. Yeah, so that, okay, they, um, they're part dark now. Alright, and water gun. Finish him off! Sweet! Hey, nice! Uh, Sleet Strike. What's this? Covers the body in a layer of ice to lightly tackle the opponent, may lower attack or frostbite. Uh, let's get rid of Pound. We're definitely more of a special attacker, but it could come in handy. Ow! We tried our best. Yes, you did. Look, haven't you all had enough? Can you just convince the big one to give back the artifact that she stole? Oh, and they scattered. Hey, get back here! Ugh! Well, Volti, how do you see this going? Uh, ready to fight. Yeah, I can feel a fight starting, at, uh, starting in my bones. Taking care of these at Sandar feels more like babysitting than actual combat. And they don't actually seem like bad kids. But I don't think the Croc Rock is going to be as playful. I'm getting really nervous, but let's try to get ourselves ready for a fight. Okay. Got some cash. Nice. Yeah, as I was saying, like, I really wanted like, a Mystery Dungeon game. Like a new one has been... It's been too long, man. Way too long. What was the last one? Super Mystery Dungeon? No, it was the remake on Switch. I kind of fancy playing the uh, the 3DS one, because I haven't played that in so long. Uh, Gates to Infinity, I think it was, I'm thinking of. But hey, oh. No, they're here. I know. Hey, oh. Good afternoon. It's almost night, but okay. <laughs> Guess good evening, but uh, hey. What are you doing hiding behind your Poplio friend? Uh, get out of here. Okay, sorry. Actually, wait. I just cleaned those. Feet off the stairs, please. Uh, okay. Uh, so, what do you want? The weird looking rock? Yeah, uh, I think it'd be really nice if you could give that back. Cool, that works for me. Wait, what? So, how much do you want for it? What? No, I mean, uh, give it back because it's not yours. What, for free? Look, I already had the little one size you up. Neither of you are actually able to uh, uh, take this from me by force. So I'm offering the best solution for everyone involved. Now, do what's good for you and... Hey, what kind of talk is that supposed to be? You really are nothing but a dirty outlaw, aren't you? And don't you think you're being a terrible influence on these kids? What kind of example are you setting by stealing from innocent people? Oh, first of all, how dare you? Do you know how much these things are worth? I can feed everyone for an entire month with these stupid rocks. Oh, I'm done being nice. You walk into my home, get your dirty feet on my grass, and take uh, whatever you want from my plants? And you're just expecting me to play nice forever? This is your home? Uh, that's it. I'm beating your ass. <laughs> Alright, here we go. What level is it? Intimidate? That's fine, that's fine. Alright, you two idiots want to be moral do-gooders? You're really going to push me this far? I think it's perfectly reasonable to... Shut up, nerd! Okay, you're in torment, that's fine. Uh... Just go... Actually, let's go... F no, let's go water gun. I was thinking maybe trying to sleep strike, but... So much damage this does first. Oh yeah, we're fine, we've got this easy. Sizing us up, saying we can't take you on. Easily do it. Nice. Oh! Uh... Sand Dial Pile. Oh no. Sobby! Oh, we good, we good. Look, they had an arm berry on it. Ouch, that snorted. Critical hit. We got our berry as well. And last water gun, finish you off. Way easy. You were saying I couldn't beat you? Way two levels, nice. Ooh, almost free. So I do wonder if we're evolving this game. 
Part of me thinks probably not, because I'm thinking like mystery dungeon games, you don't evolve until post game, do you? But not bad. Ugh. Look, my request is final. If you can't respect that, you have to pull it straight out of my hands. So, come on now, take it! Ugh. I was really close. Don't know if we can survive another round. Stew, stew! Uh, what? What did they say? Right. Uh, what are these called again? Fossils? Meteorites? Look, I don't really care. I've just read before that uh, geeky types like to buy these or something. I've been reading the, these uh, cooking recipes by Team MSG. <laughs> yeah? I've, uh, I'd have plenty of money left over to make something nice for once. So, citrus stew. No. No way. You guys have got to give back what you stole. I'm not buying it off you. Okay, here. Hmm, really? Why? But didn't you just say... Thank you. Oh? Hey, come here. Don't want the show on. There, there, little one. See? I give it back. I was just messing with them. Hey, is that one okay? Oh yeah, for the record, I'm not an outlaw. In fact, I've never stolen anything before until now. Really, I've got to say, the, the, the rock? Is it me? Is it, I think it might be like the, the, the top bit. It kind of reminds me of Jirachi's head. Anyway. Uh, yeah, I've uh, read enough Crime Time uh, articles to know how to pickpocket something, though. I guess because I star in the desert. It's got, it's got to be Jirachi, right? Anyway. Uh, you shouldn't be too proud of that. Hey, I'm not the one cosplaying as a bounty hunter. Hiding behind someone else and munching on berries at the first moment of pain? I bet you never had to uh, save food before. It's absolutely embarrassing to watch. Aren't you guys supposed to be cool, handsome, and heroic and stuff? Hey man, I'm pretty cool and handsome. But <laughs> do me a favor and work on yourself before acting all high and mighty. Yikes, hey, that's, uh, I mean. Now hurry up and take it before I change my mind. Okay, let's go. And don't worry, I'll find another way. I mean, I get it, stealing to feed, like, your family and stuff, but, oh, man. Ah, uh, anyway, good job. So you got my artifact back for me. So I must away now, but hopefully we shall meet again. <laughs> okay, then. Well, uh, that happened quickly. As long as they're happy, at least. Hey, uh, we did great in there. Uh, you did great, I guess. I just kind of tagged along. No, man, you did good. Water guns were much appreciated, but I appreciate you trying to cheer me up. But the Crocorock was right. I was hiding behind berries under my hat and eating them after we had battles. I want to try acting like one of the bounty hunters I looked up to, but I guess I'm not fooling anyone. I've had this dream for the longest time. A bounty hunter is all I've ever wanted to be. It's uh, hard living out here in the desert, and there's a lot of Pokemon out there that are willing to take advantage of that. So I wanted to bring people a little peace of mind, someone that can really help and stand up for others. Traveling the land and bringing it justice to bad guys. So regular Pokemon can sleep a little easier. But I guess I'm not ready to be a hero. I should cheer him up somehow. Uh, no, you did great. Oh, thanks. That means a lot from someone who's uh, good in a fight like you. Enough about me, though. What do you plan to do from here? Uh, I guess try to find out how to be a human again, but you don't remember anything but your name. So you don't have anywhere to go? That's... The most bizarre thing I've ever heard. So, you don't remember anything at all? And you don't have a place to stay? I know this is a selfish request, but what would you think of becoming bounty hunters with me? You thought we worked well together in the last fight, right? And you could stay at my place. There's plenty of room. I kind of guess I've got no other choice really, have I? But uh, that's such a sudden request. But I suppose I don't have any reason not to. Exploring with Sobby might help me figure out what's going on with me. Alright, let's go then. You will? Thank you. I'll try not to let you down. Okay, first things first. Let's get out of here before the sandstorm gets worse. Alright then. So the fella's residence. Oh, you got the boys! Hey, yo. Love for links, man. Hey there, fellas. Welcome back, Sobby. Oh, welcome, uh... Oh, hey, this is Voltsy. He's new around here and needs a place to stay. Oh, no problem then. Any fella of Sobby is a fella of ours. Yep, already on it, boss. I love this so much. <laughs> They're going to get your room ready for you. Let me know if you're ready to go up. Also, I promise you're going to love it here. Already do. 
Already do. Uh, welcome to a fella's residence and inn. Uh, I'm the top brass here. Uh, how can I help you in any way? There are three of you. Actually, there's six of us, Phalanx, that work here. Run this place as a group effort. You'll start seeing us running around from time to time, getting things done. They look a little different from me, so that's how you know who's who. Uh, huh. How do I tell the other Phalanx from each other besides me? Well, I hadn't thought of that before. <laughs> Maybe we'll look into uh, personalized armor for the rest. Oh, that'd be so sick. Oh, I use like, the Phalanx like the Power Rangers. Each like Phalanx is like different color Power Ranger. That'd be kind of cool. Oh man, that's a, that's a great idea for like a, a shiny Phalanx, but... So, you're Voltsy. It's nice to meet you, Mr. Voltsy. My child and I live here as well, so I suppose we'll be seeing each other regularly from now on. Hey -o. Oh hey, uh, you new here? That's a little irresponsible one, fellas. Hey partner, don't be rude now. Look, I'm just saying you can't trust anyone out here so easily. It doesn't look like you're a bad Pokemon, so I can only hope we get along. Okay, fair enough. Also, I want to save the game since it's been a while. Just say save the game, first time. Can we go to people's rooms? Uh, doesn't belong to me, okay. Hey there, fella. There's a fella in, in here getting your room ready still, but it shouldn't take much longer. Okay. So, welcome to fella's fella. Don't be shy about food. We, uh, we work hard so everyone that lives here gets to eat well. Okay. Uh, guess talk to you then. Cool, just follow me upstairs. Alright. Up we go. Let's go check out our room. Uh, you made it just in time. All set. You two can go right, right ahead in. Alright, let's go check out my room. Well, our room, I guess, but this is it. They had to uh, reorganize a bit for your bed. And speaking of, ugh, I'm really tired. Tomorrow I can show you around Sandy Square and then get us registered as bounty hunters. But until then, I'm gonna get a good night's rest. Good night, Voltsy. Okay then. Do we just go to sleep as well? Would you like to take a rest? Saving is recommended before advancing to the next day. All right, let's just uh, save just in case. All right, let's sleep. So far this game is very charming, very well written, looks great, feels great, but today has been really interesting. Met Sobby, I fought off some Pokemon, I have a new place to stay, and apparently I'm going to become a bounty hunter tomorrow. But why am I here? Was I doing something before I met Sobby? I feel like I'm forgetting something really important. Maybe we'll start having dreams, but the next day... Oh, and Sobby's gone. Oh. Good morning, Mr. Voltsy. I hope you slept well. I believe your friend Sobby is waiting for you downstairs. Also, you really shouldn't skip breakfast next time. Man, so I slept in. Me and pancakes. Ooh, nice. Uh, so good morning, fella. Hope the bed was to your liking. Yeah, it was alright. I do us. Hey, you think this is a real Bidoof head? <laughs> what? No way. It's a possibility. Wasn't this just made in honor of an actual Bidoof? He was a legendary explorer or something. Uh, also, I don't think the uh, fellas would do something so, you know. Uh, it's still a possibility. <laughs> uh, what's the other one? You got a Glaceon and a Luxray. But, um, well then, Voltsy, let's get going. So, why don't we? Alright. Let's go check out the Sandy Square. So, we joined the party. Is it like on the team like this now? Yeah, cool. Level 15. A complicated but endearing mess of a Pokemon. Sobby has big dreams of becoming a bounty hunter that allows other Pokemon to live peacefully. Aqua Jet Water Pulse, nice. Alright. A sandy square. But uh, this isn't quite it, but the whole place, the entire area where all these Pokemon live, this is called Sandy Square. We kind of glossed over the area getting back to fellas. So this is a good time as any to really introduce you. Okay, so there are sure a lot of Pokemon here. The Hunters Association places up north ahead as well as other facilities and services are like to assist bounty hunters and adventurers alike. You're free to look around if you like, Voltsy. Okay. Right, so let's start off by checking from here. There's, there's a few houses down here living this close to downtown. I'm kind of jealous. All right, uh, so. Here's the fellas. So I'll play with you, I'll play with you when mum gets back from shopping. All right, and we've got a house here. Can we go in these houses? We can't. Alright, can't check the sign either. Okay, uh, let's talk to Venonet. So the Oasis waters make me feel calm, despite everything happening around here. 
But my grandma had a family heirloom stolen recently, oh no. Uh, things really are getting out of hand nowadays, just what is the Hunters Association doing? A terrible job, that's that's what they're doing. Ah, oh, these outlaws are getting Baldor every day. <laughs> oh, that was, oh, you and your puns, I thought that was awful, but so good. Sometimes, sometimes I sometimes wonder why I'm friends with this blockhead. Because the puns, man, they're great, but also bad, but what's, what's taking the, uh, that guy so long? Wasn't that hard of a job? Oh? Wait, 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 I know it sounds bad. My buddy was getting us a job at the Bounty Hunters Association. We're bounty hunters. Oh, uh, sure. Uh-huh. If you see a double around here, tell him to hurry back. Okay, will do. Oh, diddly dear. For all these bad Pokemon around recently, I can't help but feel nervous. You two should uh, stay safe out there. I mean, I'll try. Today's the day. We're going to find that outlaw and bring them to justice. Yeah. Okay, then. Got a lone executor and a pincer. But I've hammered a lot of those guys today. Wait, what? Eggy. We've done our quote for today. Let's just go take a load off at the Hunters Association. Got a store. Uh, hmm, I'm gonna get you. So the Kickdown General Store sells a variety of basic items every day. The item stock is limited, but don't worry. We always refresh the next day, sometimes with new kind of items. Both shop on the ends of the Sandy Square, get their merchandise from the same inventory. So it doesn't matter which one you end up going to. <laughs> okay then. Uh... Deals rock type damage with high accuracy. Should we get like one of these? In case we want to do rock damage. Alright, so this takes us oh, out of town. I'm guessing the right side will have obviously the Kekla and what another Pokemon maybe speak to. Yep. Okay, so I need to find them no matter the cost. Darn, I can't say for certain you'll find what you seek out in those dungeons. Still, I am certainly willing to accompany you for a time. Thanks, I appreciate it. Alright, so let's go up north and this should be the Hunters Association up here then. Ooh, okay, uh... That's right, it's us. Oh, the Dancing uh, Mariachi uh, Cactus Associates. Or DMCA, if you will. <laughs> here to steal your girls and shake it up. Or boys, if you're into that. Boss, don't forget the genderless Pokemon. No, you're totally right, Cack, my man. Boss, I'm, I'm a girl. Okay, dance! Alright then. Uh, so what's this? Hariyama Dojo. Seems to be closed, okay. So I guess the further we progress in the game, the more we bring this like Sandy Square back to life. Got a restaurant. Oh, Volti. Uh, these guys are a, a catering establishment, so don't see any guests. Let's not bother them, okay. Let's talk to you. Looking for a place to work for baking. That's why I came all the way out here to Sandy Square from the Highland Plains. Alright, that's dead end. So let's go to the top and this should be the Hunters. No, there's still more. Gold, it's treasure. Oh, we can go in here. So I wonder if this face is edible. Uh, please don't cause trouble in here. <laughs> uh, hello, Voltsy and Sobby. It's you. Wait, I don't remember telling you our names. But thanks for getting that artifact back. It made me want to get back into an old trade of mine. Bountiful boxes. Bountiful boxes? Bountiful boxes. Bountiful boxes? Okay, but what do they do? Basically, you get bountiful boxes as rewards from bounties. Bring them to me and I'll open them for a price. And then you get to keep what's inside. Whatever that may be. Oh, that's pretty cool. Bring a bountiful box to me and I'll open them for a price. Okay. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Let's talk to you next. Oh. Ah, what a design. I'm a genius, yeah. Uh, oh, I'm one of the Pokemon who built this city. Though it didn't go exactly as planned. Nope. One of my powers gave me this design to go off. Wanna take a look? Sure. Yeah, I knew you couldn't resist. Feast your eyes on this masterpiece. I mean... Not bad. So, what do you think? I know, I know, it's incredible. So that's what you're gonna say, yeah? I mean, to be fair, yeah. Looking at that, it's like, I mean, you can tell what they were going for, and yeah, I think you did a good job. Got a Blast Seed, sweet. Uh, so we'll check like how Blast Seed works in this. Uh, just can't read it, but it's fine. Anything on these things? Nope, it's gonna check like, in case hidden items or something. So, what's this? Vespa Crafters. Oh, you there. 
Could it be? You've come to craft. Well, my honeys, you're in the right spot. Welcome to Vespi Crafters. If you've got the ingredients, we've got the knowledge to make what you want. I'm your host, the one and only. Vivi! So, honey, uh, you're, what will you be making today? So you can trade the materials you find during adventures for unique and powerful items at Vespi Crafters. The amount of available recipes is limited now, but you'll unlock more as you progress. Okay, uh, plain seed and a puzzleberry. Okay, we can't really make anything. Phoebe said I should study over here for a while. Should have known she had higher standards for me. I have an idea. If you give me recipes to study, I might be able to convince her to start making them. And I might be able to gain a little more respect for her. So where to get them? Well, you probably get them as you complete a lot of missions. Sounds good. My, what delightful crafts. The quality is astounding. Dare to say, the Vespi Quinn is the real deal. Phoebe is always so energetic with her work. It's up to us, worker combi, to keep up with her. Oh. You okay? Huh? Who are you? You seem new. A friend of Sobby's, I take it? How interesting. Uh, you alright? Uh, oh, was it that obvious? Well, how do I put it? There were more of us around, but some time ago we parted ways. I do wonder if they're doing alright. It'd be nice to see them again. I guess what I'm trying to say is... Would you keep an eye out for them? Yeah, sure. Great, I appreciate it. If you give them a hand, that will help you in return. Uh, there is one place I have a feeling of where they could be. Ooh. Okay, cool. Cedar. He should be in... Well, I'm not sure, but I heard it was a very luscious and green place. Not sure if you can find a place like that yet, but I hope it goes well. I'm sure you'll know when you see it. Okay. Wish I could be as good at crafting as Vivi. Maybe one day, when I finally evolve. Maybe. Alright. Uh... Smiggles moves. Okay. So what can I even do right now? This can't keep going on. Hmm. Oh, welcome. This is Smiggles Move Paints. I'd normally help people relearn some moves they forget, but uh, I have no motivation, no muse. It's pretty bad, to be honest. So uh, not doing any move work until I can sort that. Sorry. Maybe we need to make something could like. Is there some place we can craft? Okay. Uh, what do we need to make? So we'd like to check the missions. Oh, mission log. There you go. So speak to craft a combi, okay. Let's get this done first. Uh, this one. Uh, I don't think it's this one. Oh, wait. Hmm, something for Smiggle's motivation. Ah, this might do it. Artsy types love this sort of thing. You need some gravel rock to pull it off. Ooh, gravel statue, okay. So I go to you. Uh, oh, we need three. I only got one. Okay, make sure to hold on to them then when we go to a dungeon. Alright, let's go check this out. Ooh. It's looking pretty sick, man. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm already uh, getting super nervous. Oh man, it looks lively. Yeah, there are definitely a lot of Pokemon hanging around here. I'm not really sure how the official process works though. Excuse me, uh, may I help you? This is the Hunters Association main building, right? Correct. We employ and offer a wide variety of services, but this is the main purpose of this establishment, yes. So, um, how do I get signed up to start fighting outlaws? <laughs> uh, okay, are you sure? Yes. Okay. I don't get it. Uh, did we blow it? I hope not. Definitely could have been a little bit more confident. Oh. Hey oh. The chairman seeks an audience with you. Simply enter through the stairs behind this counter. Wow, really? Thank you so much. Just a moment. Your position is not guaranteed. He will simply screen you for necessary qualifications. You should temper your expectations. I... Oh, I see. I just made him even more nervous. Hope this ends well for both of us. Alright, let's go talk to some people. There's a lot of people applying to be bounty hunters. Not all of them get through screening, though it's meant to be a dangerous job, so they don't just take anyone. Okay. Uh, Go really helps cover my back when we're out chasing outlaws. My partner and I are bounty hunters here, and I'm the brains and he's the brawn. Get it, because psychic and fighting. But the food is pretty good here. Oh, have you heard about food items like chestnuts and apples? I haven't. Chestnut and apples that make you stronger. Oh, okay, cool. 
And Didi is such a mysterious character, who knows what kind of things he's experienced. Uh, this looks like a good one to search for, and it only took 30 minutes. 30 minutes? You're doable, right? A silent that sent us to call out if we saw you. You've been gone a while. Oh, shoot. I forgot how much he hates waiting. So thanks for reminding me. I'm going to go meet up with him now. Okay. Uh, right. Can I play the piano? Nope. Ah, you're the done. <laughs> oh man, how do you keep beating me at this game? Neither of us have opposable thumbs. <laughs> We're in the corner. I wonder if I can get into that hole back there. I mean, I'll give it a try, but okay. So you really are my light in the dark, Hello, Mines. Uh, Volby's my childhood friend. He's got uh, got into a, a bit of a rough crowd growing up, but I've helped him overcome that and we're closer. That's nice. Oh, one of the boys is here. Hi, right, fellas. Yeah, what are you doing here? We actually help out from time to time. If we didn't, we'd run out of food. I see. Helping others is how the world goes around. Remember that, fellas. Alright. So, down we go. That's a bit of a mess here. Oh, I feel like I have a headache, or a stomachache, or a heartache. Uh, we'll be fine. Yeah, maybe you're right. I would not be so certain. Oh, who's the boss? Oh, it's a honchcrow. In fact, a very great many things may go wrong. For those taking the path of the bounty hunters. You must be brave. You must be strong. And above all else, you must be ready for any danger. Oh, okay. And? And? What? You two lost? Uh, no. We're the two that you just requested an audience with. Huh, could have fooled me. Come on now, popular in a subble, that's it? What? What? Don't you want me like that? This kind of work isn't for amateurs. Why don't you uh, kids get like a job st uh, stock in uh, boxes or something? Stay safe and all that. Oh, man, I'm a bounty hunter. Hey, I'm not that young. <laughs> I heard the restaurant down the street needs a dishwasher. They don't pay too badly, I think. Uh, so, Sobby's dream is... Foxy? Oh yeah? Justice? What do you know about justice? You think you can just defeat any outlaw that comes your way? You need to wipe the stars out of your eyes, kids. Of course not. Not at all. I don't think anyone is perfect, especially us. But willing to put in the work. Every Pokemon around the world deserves to live a peaceful and happy life. Mr. Chairman, you just have to give us a chance to help realize that. Living here brings a lot of problems. The heat of the sun, the scarcity of the food, and there are many bad Pokemon out there. Even good Pokemon get desperate and begin to take advantage of others. And while there are those that try to fight and do the right thing, I, it's not always safe and easy work. I know, but I'll be ready. We're ready for anything the world wants to throw at us. Didi? Didi, my friend. Could you get, get down here? So what do you need? Can you recall to me uh, what these two did the other day? Certainly. These two entered through the wilds and cornered a Crocorock who had stolen a certain item. And how'd it go? Hmm, it wasn't too convincing. What? Although they had successfully led a fight uh, that resulted in that item's retrieval, there are other factors to the ordeal that I believe work too generously in their favor. Okay, thanks. Of course. Uh, how did he know all of that? He's my employee of the month. What? <laughs> that makes sense. Nice hat. Uh, uh thanks. <laughs> okay, here's my offer. Oh? What, really? There's a place called a Dusty Ravine that I want you to go to. There are a lot of Pokemon itching for a fight these days, so it'll be good practice. Now I want you to take down a powerful and dangerous Pokemon that's hiding out there. An outlaw. You can't miss him. He sits out like a broken wing. He's an all-arounder that's committed hundreds of crimes. Now I need you to put him in his place once and for all. Oh, and, uh, give this to him. What, you want me to give the outlaw a handwritten letter? Shouldn't you just arrest whoever it is? No need for questions. This is your test in order to become an official bounty hunter. If this goes well, then we will give you the necessary equipment to begin arresting criminals. We're really gonna make it. We'll bring that thief to justice. You have our word. Excellent. I'll look forward to hearing from you. Okay, Voltsy. This is it, our first mission. Let's get ready and head to the field. All right, let's go. We can now head to Dusty Ravine. You will periodically unlock more areas to venture through as you become established bounty hunters. 
Get into the field, simply walk leftmost or rightmost of Sandy Square and select the area you wish to visit. Oh hey Voltsy, now that we have our first mission, I figured it would be a good idea to show you my journal. Well, at least with my journal. But I'll like, repurpose it. That's cool that the mission log already checked it out, but uh, we should write down whatever tasks we have assigned to us and keep track of them. Okay. Right, I wonder if I can get any more little missions from this board. No. Maybe when we become like a full-fledged bounty hunter we can do it. So before we go off to Dusty Ravine, let's go and see the Grubble and the Salandit and see if anything happens there. Hey yo. Seriously, how was that? that hard to find a beginner job? I got the notice. This one will be easy for sure. Okay. But you know what? I think it's probably a great place to end this part off. Next episode, we begin our, I guess, like, trial mission. Is that even saving the game? Yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Right, I'll catch you guys next time. I'm loving this game so far and I can't wait to see how it's going to progress. Ooh, this is going to be so good. But again, a reminder, if you guys want to play this, check the comments down below. Check the pinned comment and I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great day. Peace.